As we head north to Venice, we reflect back on our highlights of Florence. Oh, this is a terrific place. I don't like the bike riders going to that tiny alley. Mm -hmm. oh, I admire how they drive, and they're real courteous. Uh -huh. The only thing I admire about that, going <laughs> zip, zipping all around the tight alley. The, oh, here it is. You know, when you open this, the coin slides out, oh, and yeah. you can pick easily. Uh -huh. You see. know? Show me the coin. Yeah, you see? Yeah. You can pick the, uh, the, uh, the dime or pennies or whatever, and then it slides back and you close it. Wow. So this is the best coin uh, purse that um, I'm going to enjoy this because the ones that I have, uh, I have to really empty it on in my hand and then you know pick right. so this is terrific yeah especially with all the strange coins we're getting yes, here yes and oh my this is gonna last me oh quite a long time well i enjoyed florence because i think i'm learning the culture by culture i mean for example i saw the statue of davis that was uh, done by michelangelo uh -huh. and then you know you learn a lot about the other artists Botticelli, raphael and the enunciation and madonna and the child and dennis explained all these things and it really made sense to me now that i come to florence and to see this great artists produce these things and I think it really meant a lot. Yeah, it, good. It's more meaningful now. Really? The beginnings of the Renaissance, yes, all that great stuff. And how about yourself? What did you like here? Well, I like Florence because, as my husband said, that uh, he learned a lot with all the art and the sculptures. So I really like the leather goods that they have, which was mentioned by Masa here, and uh, leather products at the Catholic Church was terrific. You know, I was able to do a lot of shopping. And I think that Dennis is doing a tremendous job with his tour because he's trying to give us whatever information he has and much more. So it makes this European trip uh, very meaningful for me. Nice, a nice size, very, you know, charming city. Well, I, I was most impressed with David. I didn't know, it, you know, I hear the word David, David, but when you told me the story of David, well, yeah. it really piqued my interest. And I yeah. really enjoyed that museum there. It really yeah. was good. Florence I loved. Two highlights for me were the P.T. Palace and Statue of David, of course. But the P.T. Palace really impressed me with its opulence and its grandeur and paintings galore. Uh -huh. Seeing how the richest family in Europe lived. Really? I really love Florence though, it was a charming city. Yeah. Um, yeah, I really loved Florence. I thought it was real charming. And the thing that really added to the whole feel and look of that place were the church bells that chimed mm -hmm. in the night. And, and uh, I just want to say one thing uh, the trip up to now, the tour. Our family, you know, it's been a wonderful trip for the whole family. After all these years when they were little kids, we traveled together and it's the first time we're doing it and for a very special occasion. So yeah. it's been wonderful. Your 50th anniversary, <laughs> right? right? <laughs> um, Uffizi was nice. Um, uh, Pity Palace was nice. Of course, David was something else, something special. And I think your plan of going at the right time was really uh, very good. Mm -hmm. I think we went there just at the right time and um, yeah. those things really made the trip, um, we condensed everything. Every, every bit of time was used very wisely. Uh -huh. Oh, Florence was fabulous. Seeing that statue of David, all the sculpture, the paintings, the Raphael's, oh, Bellini's, Bernini's, Brunelleschi's, uh -huh. oh, it was wonderful. The architecture just went fabulous. And to see Michelangelo's tomb, you know, really made it come alive for me and all the information that Dennis gave us. He's a walk, walking encyclopedia, it's just fabulous. <laughs> just gave me goosebumps all over. It's just a dream come true for me. It was Florence, it was wonderful. Yeah, that's good. And you said about everything, <laughs> but the highlight was seeing David. 
the statue and also seeing the um, the uh, unfinished uh, uh, statues oh, yeah. there. That was, you know, I've never seen that, you know, how they do the carvings and, and whatnot. And I enjoyed that Duomo. That was very impressive for me. Really? It's amazing. You know, it's one thing to see, to read about it, and it's another to actually see it, to see David, to see the Duomo and the baptistry. It's really fantastic. And also to learn about the Medici family. That to me was fascinating too, to learn about the, the family, their influence on the city and throughout Italy from the city. And, uh, and the World Guild, what, it's the part that it played. That to me was very educational. Mm -hmm. really. Florence. Florence, Florence was awesome. I especially like the, the Duomo. Uh -huh. Climbing it was a, was a thrill, it was super high. Um, this narrow, people going down, people coming up, you're like, excuse me, excuse me. But when you get to the top, it's totally worth it. It's yeah. a it's a great, great view. It's beautiful. Really. It's Next worth time, I it's, do that again. I did yeah. it once, but I gotta do it again. It's worth trying. You, yeah. you know, just and it's not and that I saw it's not that hard speak, actually. You no. know, I saw people probably above their sixties doing it. So, uh -huh. you know, just take your time and do it if you can because it's just unbelievable the uh -huh. view up there. Mm -hmm. And other than that, the shopping's really oh, good. They yeah. have a lot of leather and um, the people were really <laughs> nice and helpful. Ah, oh, let's see. My first impression was charmingly decaying buildings. Just everywhere you look. The food was wonderful. The shopping was wonderful. <laughs> and it was culminated by the gondola ride down the back alleys yeah. with the musicians. That it's it's a photographer's dream, and uh, Kodak's gonna love me when I when they get when they get my bill. But every time you turn a corner, there's a picture, I, or just everywhere you look, it's 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 wonderful.